This comment from Dr. Brian is a really good comment. I'm not actually coming for him, so just to be clear, this is not me attacking Dr. Brian. I don't know what kind of doctor he is, but here we go. Meat-based is just another way of saying you don't eat vegetables, which is the standard diet of most Americans. Y'all act like plant-based is the default. I agree with you mostly, Dr. Brian. I do in fact believe that most Americans are not out here eating a lot of fresh fruits and vegetables, but I think they are unwittingly eating a plant-based diet because so many, and I'm speaking from experience, uh, most of the people in my life do not eat the way that I eat, surprise, surprise. And when I look at their kitchens, when I look at their refrigerators, when I look in their pantries, most of that food is indeed plant-based. <laughs> Potato chips, oatmeal, cereal, french fries, snackity snack snacks, right? So there is some meat in the refrigerator and every now and then there's some vegetables which often go bad and get tossed in the trash. Most of what's in my friends and family's kitchens and pantries and refrigerators is indeed plant-based. So I don't think plant-based is the default on purpose for most people. I don't think most people are going to the grocery store and shopping for plant-based products. But I do think that plant-based products make up a big part of most Americans' diets. Even when they go to fast food restaurants, there's one beef patty, two buns, a pile of vegetables, and some deep fried potatoes, and a nice diet soft drink. And that's not because they want to be plant-based. That's just how the meal is made. One piece of meat, usually it's a quarter pounder. That's really not that much protein. And then the rest of it's plant-based. So. No, I totally agree with you. I think most, most Americans aren't eating a, a lot of fresh fruits and uh, vegetables. However, plant-based nonetheless. Anyways, hope this helps.